to the district tonight, where Metro bus drivers are furious after one of their own had a cup of urine thrown on her. Police have a woman under arrest for that assault, and they are demanding Metro do more to keep them and you safe. Transportation reporter Pete Muntean is here now with that. Adam, I just spoke exclusively to bus operators who are really upset about this. Some even know the victim of this assault. She was attacked less than 90 days into her new job. Now her union could start taking action because they say Metro is not. It's a disgusting act. Jamsia Campbell like is that. angry yeah. on behalf of her friend, the bus operator in this video. Metro Transit Police say it was last Saturday when the driver told this woman to have a nice day. The suspect, Opal Brown, can be seen throwing a cup of urine on the driver. Disgusted at the behavior of someone urinating on a fellow employee, a co-worker of mine, hasn't even been in the door 90 days. Campbell drives the X2 route where this happened. Driver assaults on these buses have been a problem for Metro. Video monitors and sliding plexiglass barriers have been installed to protect drivers. I had a passage of spat in my face. Barry Wilson says all that's left is adding Metro Transit Police on buses. We understand that they might be understaffed right now, but you know this has been going on for years. I've been here going on 18 years now. We've been having assaults. The union wants to take action soon. Drivers say it's Metro's turn to steer them to safety. It's definitely going to have to lead to a change because we as local 689 members are now taking actions within ourselves to try to do something to try to help and protect our operators while we are here on the line. It is possible local 689 members could take some action before the weekend. It's not exactly clear yet what they will do. Remember back in April, workers threatened a sick out over WMATA's new absence policy. By the way, sources tell me the driver in this case is not back on the job yet. Pete Mundine, WUSA 9.